Hi everyone, it's Jill Celeste from YourBrandingPower.com, where entrepreneurs and career professionals learn to master social media to grow their personal brands so they can attract more clients, get better job offers, and make more money. Today I want to talk to you about your calling and your passions and how that relates to your personal brand. I was recently on Facebook and one of my Facebook friends posted a quote from my business school mentor, Fabian Fredrickson, and she wondered if this quote was true. And let me read it to you. It says, the things you are passionate about are not random. They are your calling. And when my friend posted this, she said, gosh, I wonder if this is true. And I, I really just wanted to shout from the rooftops, yes, yes, this is 100% true. I believe that we are all here for a purpose. And some of us figure, that out, figure out our purposes very early on in our lives. And some of us, it's a bit of a longer journey. We get signs along the way, though, which seem to point out what our purpose is. And I believe that those signs, those sort of seemingly random signs, are pointing us to what our true calling is. When I was a little girl, I always wanted to be a teacher. I had a chalkboard. I had um, one of my teachers gave me a teacher's edition as a gift you know, to play with. I um, struggled, I helped with students who were struggling in school. And when I went off to college, I had determined I wanted to be an English teacher. I had declared a major for English education. I had, was in a program where I taught adults how to read. You know, so everything was about education. And then, you know, life happened, and I ended up changing my degree and starting a career in public relations and marketing. Fast forward to last spring, spring of 2013, and I realized, you know, all these signs that I had been ignoring, even in my corporate world life, where I was constantly training people on different things, was telling me that I needed to be teaching. And that's when I decided to become a personal branding coach to teach people how to build a powerful and trustworthy personal brand so they can do better with their business or with their career. Now, you may be thinking, okay, well, that's great, Jill, but how does your passion and your calling relate to personal branding? Well, I believe they are very much connected. To me, a personal brand is the embodiment of your purpose and your calling. It's sort of like that marketing package that you put on so that people get to learn and know about you and you can do a personal branding strategy. I believe that in order to have an effective personal brand, it has to be related to whatever you're passionate about and whatever you are um, feeling your calling is. For example, if you're sharing knowledge about something you're not passionate about, you're not going to have an authentic personal brand and you're going to be miserable as a result. So if you're at the point where you're still not 100% sure what your personal brand is, what your calling is, what I recommend is just take a few minutes in a quiet place and write down some thoughts. You know, ask yourself, what are you really passionate about? What would you love to get paid to do even though you would do it for free? What do you want to be known for? And you know, these types of questions, real introspective and write it down. And the answers to those questions will point you to what your passion and your calling is and that will help you formulate an authentic personal brand for your business or for your career. I hope these tips help you as you think about your own personal branding journey. And if you need more assistance with personal branding, please visit my website at www.yourbrandingpower.com. And until next time, here's to your personal branding success and have a great day.